In Number Worlds, there are three implementation options, 30 minutes, 45, or 60 minutes. In this video, we're going to concentrate on the 45-minute implementation option for Number Worlds. In order to begin your 45 minute implementation option for Number Worlds, you'll start with this page and you're going to click on Lesson Plans to begin planning for your lesson. Once you click on Lesson Plan, you'll see that you have the option to select 60, 45, or 30. Let's select 45 minutes. Each 45 minute lesson has an objective, a standard, and it also has a create context for your English learners or for any student who has low vocabulary. It will also list materials. The program materials listed here are the materials that are in your Number Worlds kit. The other materials are materials that you'll need to provide to your students. Underneath the materials, you'll see all the resources needed to teach this lesson. You'll have your Teacher's Edition ebook. You'll have a letter to home, which is a great way to stay connected to the home. You'll also have an activity card. The activity card houses all of the hands-on activities and games for students. You'll have access to building block activities, which we'll discuss further in later videos. But these are great fun activities for students to do on their own on the computer. You'll have access to English learner resources, an English learner support guide, as well as an oral assessment for English learners. You have a practice book, which provides more or additional practice, as well as your student workbook, which is independent practice for students. Also listed here is your unit pretest. Every unit has a pretest that students can take online to see what they know about that unit's topic and skills. If you want to plan for tomorrow's lesson, you simply scroll down, and every lesson in this five-day lesson plan has a drop-down menu. If I click on Lesson 2, it shows me Lesson 2, Objectives, standards, materials, and resources for lesson two. But let's take a look at the teacher's ebook. This is really the way that you're going to be able to teach number worlds. Your teacher's ebook is a direct replica of your print teacher's edition. You can look at it at a single page view or a double page view. If it's too small, you can zoom in to see it more clearly. The Teacher's Edition ebook will also have listed your objectives, your standards, creating context for your English learners or any students with low vocabulary, and your program and additional materials. In the 45-minute implementation option, you are going to focus in on the Engage section. The Engage section is where you're going to teach the skill or concept for the student. In this Engage section, you will have a hands-on activity using the activity card, which you can also access in your lesson plans from your teacher page. This hands-on activity allows students to have hands-on experience with the skill or concept. You'll also do practice in the Engage section and the 45-minute implementation option. The practice includes student workbook that you see here on the right-hand side. The student workbook is independent practice. In the 45 implementation option, you're going to do some differentiation. The differentiation is both in digital format as well as print resources. What's great about this is students have an opportunity to go on the computer to practice the skill or concept in a fun, game-like environment through building blocks. You also have an opportunity for differentiation for two different kinds of groups. Students who don't need an additional practice with you, but also students who may need some supportive practice with you. This is also included in the 45 implementation model. On the fifth day of this implementation model, students will take an assessment. They'll still participate in the Engage section, but now they'll participate in the assessment, which is a weekly assessment. What's also exciting in this implementation model is that you'll have an opportunity to do project-based learning. In your electronic uh, ebook or in your print teacher's edition, after lesson five, you will see the project-based learning lesson. This is really exciting for students because it allows them to actually bring in the real world and connect it to mathematics. Every week you'll have a project-based learning activity during the assessment day, which is day five. You'll have project evaluation criteria that's linked to an essential question. You'll also have the standard that you'll be working with and materials that you may use. Some will be in program and some will be additional. It'll also give you some hints to some best practices when teaching project-based learning.
The project-based learning is a quick activity but really makes a connection to the real world. There are really three parts every week to this project. Introduce, explore, and wrap up. Each project-based learning has an activity in the student workbook. This is week one's project. Now next week's project builds on week one. Each week the project builds until a culminating activity on week six. The project-based learning is an exciting part of the 45-minute implementation model.